How to Lose Items on eBay from AliExpress Hello and welcome to our channel, WebWiz. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to list items on eBay from AliExpress. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. So the first thing that you need to do is to open your browser and kind of go to AliExpress.com and eBay.com. And don't forget to register or log in with your existing AliExpress account. And on the homepage of AliExpress, you will see a variety of items that are currently selling. But if you're looking for a specific item, you can go to search bar and type the item you're looking for. So let's say I'm trying to find men's clothing. So I'm going to choose this trends 2023. And upon clicking enter, you will be directed in here, in which below is the search result of the thing that you search. And as you can see, there's a variety of results under this searches of men's clothing. You will see the preview picture and its corresponding prices, including the number of sold or even the name of the shop or seller. And you can also see if the seller or the specific items are offering a pre-shipping. But if you're not satisfied with the result, you can narrow it down by clicking the sort by and select orders. You can also search the items that offers a pre-shipping or the stores that has a 4 star rating and above. And if you are now satisfied with the result, you can choose any of this item below. So let's say I'm going to choose this one. So kind of click on it and you will be directed in the next tab. And from here, you will see all the details and information about this product. In which on the left side panel, you will see the preview picture of the product or item. While on the right side panel, you will see the description or title of this item. And below the description, you also see the star rating, in which the number of star, the more trustworthy this item to buy. You can also see the discount that has been less in this item. You will also see the variation, such as the color, and below the sizes, such as medium, large, extra large, double XL, and triple XL. And as you can see, this product also offers a free shipping. It will also show you where country this product or item come from. And now that we explore what this item or details contain, we can now start making listing. But before that, we're going to save this picture, in which it will serve as our green photo of our product. And after saving the photo, the next thing that we need to do is to copy the description of this item. So just select this and copy the context. And now the next thing that we need to do is to go to ebay.com in which don't forget to register or log in with your existing eBay account. And on the home page of eBay, you can select on the top right corner the option that says sell. In which upon clicking on it, you will be directed in here. In which under the selling, you will see a basic step in order to list your item. In which the first step is to list your item. And it followed by get seller protection and lastly to choose when you get paid so to proceed listing an item all we need to do is to scroll up and proceed by clicking the blue button that says list an item and you will be directed in here and before you start listing it will show you the three steps on starting your listing so the first one is to type your keywords like brand model or other details in the search bar above well, the second is to choose from possible matches to help jumpstart your listing. Well, the third one is to preview, make changes, and then list your item. So now, we can now proceed by clicking the search bar and paste the description that we just copied. And proceed by clicking the search button. In which upon doing so, you will be directed in here. And as you can see, based on the description that we paste, there's no matches found. But if you want to add details to sharpen the results, you can choose on the left side panel the category that you can fill out, such as the size type, so I'm going to choose regular. And after that, we can proceed in other category, such as sleeve length, I'm going to select short sleeve. And after that, let's proceed by choosing the color, in which there's a variety of color that you can choose. But I'm going to choose the beige color. And after that, the next category is the pattern. So kind of click on it and select the pattern that you prefer. So I'm going to choose camouflage. While for the last category is the closure. And in this option, I'm going to select debacle. 
but if still there's no matches found, you can proceed by clicking Continue without match, and proceed by selecting the condition of your item, and click Continue to Listing. And upon clicking on it, you will be directed in here, in which from here, all you need to do is to fill out all of the required information, including this item specifics, which is needed by the buyer in order to find the details of your item. And these include the condition, size type, sleeve length, type, brand, size, color, and department. Well, if you scroll down below, you will need to add a photo to increase your buyer's confidence in buying your product. And it says here that you can import 24 photos for free. And to do that, all you need to do is to click this button that says Add from your computer. In which upon clicking on it, you can choose different kind of photos that you want to import. And make sure that the file type is JPEG or PNG. And after successfully importing photos, you will see it in here. And below the photo, you will see the description that provided by eBay. And if you want to change this, all you need to do is to click the button that says Change. And below that is the pricing section, in which as you can see, I have auction as pricing methods. In which from here, all you need to do is to enter the start bidding price. But if you don't want auction as pricing method, you can change this by buy it now option. So just turn this on and turn off the auction method. But you also need to enter or input the price of your product. And after entering the price of your item, you can also see below the two options such as schedule listing start time and the quantity, in which under the quantity, all you need to do is to enter the number of items you have on hand. And if you scroll down below, you will see the postage section, in which you can select a postage service, such as to ship your item or by local pickup in which if you choose the local pickup, buyers can pick up the item from your home or another location of your choice. And below is the listing preference. And as you can see, the payment methods that we currently have is payments managed by eBay. And if you want to change that, kind of click the blue text that says change. But if you are now done of editing or customizing all of the information or details of your item, all you need to do is to click the preview, in which under the preview, you will see all of the details that you just input and the format of what this looks like if you're now going to buy this item. And this includes the pictures, the description, and the corresponding prices. You also see the three buttons such as buy it now, add to cart, and add to watch list. It also includes the payment methods. And as you can see, only Google Pay is allowed and also no returns is accepted. And if you are now sure for the format or the details of this item, all you need to do is to click the blue button that says List It. So that is just how to list items on eBay from AliExpress. Thank you.